In this video I'm going to show you how to use the Casio FX991ES model to multiply matrices. So here I've got a 2x2 two two matrix and a 2x1 matrix. So we've got 4, 0, 1, 2 and 3, 5. And what we're going to do is we're going to use the Casio to multiply these two matrices together. So first of all we need to change our calculator into the matrix mode, so or matrices mode. Uh, so press mode at the top and you'll get your different modes and we want matrices which is number 6, so number 6 matrix. So uh, what we've got here is we've now put our calculator into matrix mode, MAT. I've just pressed all clear with that prompt. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to input our matrices. So to input our first matrix, we're going to press shift and you can see above 4 we've got the word matrix. So press 4 and we're going to input data. So it's where it says DIM, so we're going to press number 1. And then I prompt us for which matrix we're going to call it. We can store up to three matrices into the calculator. So let's store it as matrix 1, which would be matrix A. Uh, so press number 1. And it's a 2x2 two two matrix, so 2x2 two two matrix would be number 5. Let's input our values so for our elements. 4, 0, 1, 2. So 4, and then 0, and then 1, and then 2. And you can see if we press equals, we've got all the, all the uh, cells entered. Make sure you've pressed that equals the last time to make sure the two's gone into that last um, place there. Okay, so we've inputted matrix A. Now we're going to input matrix B. So just press the SE button and press shift and then four again, the matrix. Let's go into the matrix uh, area. Uh, what we're going to do is input data again. So DIM, so number one. And it'll ask us which uh, matrix we're going to put it in. Let's put it as matrix B, so number 2. And uh, this time it's a 2 by 1 matrix, so number 6. So it's 3, 5, so 3, and then 5, and then it equals. Make sure the 5 has gone in there, so it has. And then press AC. Now what we're going to do is we're going to multiply these two matrices together. So what we're going to do is we're just going to press Shift, and then the matrix one, well, just Shift 4. And what we're going to do is we're going to want matrix A, so that's number 3. And we're just going to times that by, so press times and shift number 4 and then we can press number 4 which is matrix B and then press equals and let's come up with our answer which is 12, 13. So our answer to that sum would be 12, 13. Obviously you could do 4 times 3 which is 12, 0 times 5 which is 0 and add them together to get 12 and you could do 1 times 3 and 2 times 5 to get 13 whenever you add them together. That's it. Uh, but it's, it's a really useful way to multiply matrices together. Uh, whenever you're inputting your matrix, so shift 4 and number 1, you can choose, uh, if I choose matrix C here, we've got lots of different uh, re um, arrangements that we can choose. So for instance, and if you scroll down, there's more options down here. Okay, uh, And that's it. So that's how you can use your Casio calculator to check whenever you're multiplying matrices together that you've done it correctly.